Hey y'all, out here at the uh, Mo Party at the Chattanooga stop of the Power Tour 2013, and uh, my boys at Ringgold, Georgia, brought some SRT stuff, and they got a really special Viper, one of one, Viper history, 2013 piece car, all documented. Um, very cool car. So, anyways, let me run Andy down. I'll have him tell us more about it. Andy, how are you, brother? Doing well, Scotty. How are you? Not too bad. Good, tell, good. tell me a little bit about this hot rod. Well, what we've got is a 2013 uh, GTS launch edition Viper. Uh, they're only doing 150 of them with the blue and white uh, and then never doing it again. We've got number 21. We've actually had 20, number 26 and a couple others. But this is number 21 and it truly is a one of one car. Um, long story short, start of April, we were contacted by some people that were over the Viper Cup race and the NARA race at Road Atlanta. Uh, SRT was supposed to send a Viper down and last minute couldn't do it. They contacted our owner and said, if you got a Viper we can use as a base car. I said, absolutely. Uh, so we sent ours down to Road Atlanta. Um, as you can see, it was stickered up like the original base cars that they did in 96 for the Indy 500 race. Right. Um, but this car is a one of one. Um, all, all the mileage that's on it is documented uh, from start to finish because it was used in the race uh, for an entire weekend. There's quite a few miles on it. Um, but it truly is a piece of, of, of Viper history. Can I uh, see inside? Absolutely. Yeah, whenever whenever the VIN number is pulled on this car, it will be shown as a one of one. No kidding. Um, but as you can see, they've done, Man. they've done plenty of work on the on the new Vipers as compared to the, the last year of them in 2010. Right. That is gorgeous, man. The, uh, the parent company, Fiat, being an owner of a little company called Ferrari, they were able to maybe borrow a little bit of interior ideas and, and a flight in the Viper and it's you could drive this thing from here to California and be comfortable the whole way in it. And that's what the point was of the new Vipers try to refine it a little bit. Absolutely. Yeah. And that's, that's what they've done. They've made a a streetable a streetable car right. that, that anybody can get in and drive. That's what you got to do because the Corvettes are doing it, the Porsches going after that market, yeah. they're showing the yellow school bus commercials. Yeah. Everybody wants to be able to drive their supercar wherever they want to drive it yeah. to. Yeah. Whether you're you're big, small, it doesn't matter. You can get in the car and drive it. They've made it a comfortable car to drive. Um, the features that the car has with the big 8.4 inch screen, which they're kind of putting in everything now on the 8.4s, um, the technology in this car is just unbelievable. Right. Uh, I haven't been in one yet that's used the launch control feature. I'm hoping to do that sometime soon, but the car just goes. Right. Yeah, so. And it's got, so it has, can you completely turn the traction control off on it now? You can get stupid with it and okay. turn the traction control off, but. Uh, you don't advise that? No, no, no it's, it's, it's a little nerve wracking sometimes. What's this got a trunk back here? Of sorts, oh, it, it, it has it has a, a trunk area, uh, but it is a little oh, bit no, bigger. Cool. We've got all our stuff piled in here for the day. Um, one of the neat things about this car too, seeing this Corsa sticker, it's the car that Corsa used for their R&D to make their new exhaust system for the 2013 Vipers. Um, and and again, that's real carbon fiber. Oh yeah, real oh, carbon fiber dude. and the, the the deck lid, the hood, and the uh, and the, the roof. Um, it's a totally, totally different car than... Dude, the, I'm losing my mind right yeah. now, man. That is cool. How lucky am I to show up here today to shoot this, man? One, one of the really neat things that I was able to get some of the SRT drivers to do while we were in Atlanta was to sign oh, wow, that's the beautiful. strut brace for us. Um, Tommy Archer right there in the center. A lot of these other guys are going to be SRT team, member, nem, team members and drivers. Even some SRT bigwigs were down there. In Did you have the uh, the CEO or the president of it sign it? Uh, no, Giles wasn't there. We, we, we I like definitely that guy, wish man. We could he have, is yeah, cool, Super man. nice guy. Yeah. Um, we uh, we did one of the really neat things, though, that we were able to get. Randy Post. This guy set the track record at Laguna in a Viper. Then he turned around and broke it in a Corvette. Well, did a little bit more tweaking on a Viper, sent him another one, and he broke it again in a Viper. March, start of April, he was down there at the race and we let him take a few laps in the car. Uh, so he drove this car, he's autographed it, uh, which is really, really a neat experience. That is neat. I'll tell you what, they've changed They've changed the way the motor looks too. It's they've a, more I brought it up to date. Very you know? appealing. Yeah. Yeah, um, yeah no, I'm all about that, man. The heck with shooting videos. Let's take this for, you know, let's go out. That'll be fine. Yeah. Follow me. <laughs> Man, that is awesome. Can you, can you shut it up and start it up for me? Sure. <laughs>
How lucky it's am I? Way of things, since it's all carbon and it doesn't flex at all when you did it from one side. You're not getting any wobble. No, wow, very cool. Those side pipes now are set up so that you're not going to burn yourself or anything like that. Yeah, you can't. You can. I mean, you can feel the heat getting out of it, but uh, unlike the older ones, you got something there to keep you from uh, getting some third degree burn pretty easily. And it's still got the traditional way wide rear tires on it too. Yeah, Very it's, cool, it's almost man. a 14 inch wide tire. That's it's, amazing. It's, it's got some hooks on the ground, so it, uh, when the traction control kicks in, you, it, you just go. You feel like you're being thrown out of a slingshot. Yeah, I bet. Everything on the car has a purpose. It's all functional. The heat reduction scoops in the front, I mean, they're for a reason. Right. Uh, brake induction, cooling, everything. It's it's all got a purpose. It's Every all there for a reason. Turn and curve on the car has a purpose. Man, dude. Andy, you're my new best friend, brother. I appreciate it. Thanks Absolutely. so much. Anytime. Folks, there you go. 2013 Viper, the new Viper, one of one, out here at the Mo Party at the uh, Chattanooga stop of the power tour 2013 like i said go see my buddies at ringo georgia they're all about the hot rod man if you're looking for an srt you're looking for uh one of the hard to get mopars these boys can get them for you so anyways hope you all have enjoyed it see ya